start off here by saying I'm uh, completely, completely disappointed. It's unacceptable to be where we are today. I'm frustrated. I'm angry. Um, um, this was a, a tough, tough loss for us all to take. Standing here April 22nd is uh, not the way we expected our season to end. And it's a complete failure when you measure it against the expectations that we have of ourselves. We did not come even close to reaching the standard that we've set over the years here. And that's unacceptable. Any, experience, any successes that we did experience this year are completely overshadowed by the abrupt ending to our season. It's not close to good enough for anybody. And I think it's time like now to take a look in the mirror and face facts. And when you do that, you, you look at accountability, and that starts with me. I need to be better. There's no doubt about it. I'm going to take a look at all things, and I can promise you I will be better. Top to bottom, we need more. This is unacceptable to be where we are today. There will be change moving forward. Change comes in many different ways. So the specifics of how we're going to change things into next year um, are not really meant for this forum. But I can promise you we need to be better. Joel is our head coach. He will continue to be our head coach. And Joel and I are going to work together to make sure that this never happens again. Thank you. Is it stunning? I mean, how do you describe it at this point, what you guys are feeling about what happened? No, it was a major disappointment uh, across the board. I mean, uh, you know, I don't think uh, in any of the four games we had a stretch in the second period where it felt like we, we might have been competing to the level that needed in the playoffs. And then we had some stretches and maybe in game one and uh, maybe in small segments in all the four games, but not good enough. And, uh, you know, that's... Uh, you know, I don't think anybody exceeded uh, their expectations, and you know, when you don't compete to the level that's necessary, I take that personally. And as a coach, that uh, we didn't uh, find the all-out button and uh, didn't get the job done. You think that was more on you guys, or in, or in less on them, or is it? Well, give them credit. Hey, they played great, but uh, you know, I still think that uh, we didn't push uh, in, in a lot of areas, and uh, we could have had to puck a lot more in a lot of situations. Lost a lot of those one-on-one -on -one or those individual battles and uh, relentlessness and around the net, uh, you know, missing shots, missing uh, pucks. And, you know, I think that was contagious and it was, we had to be better. Joel, three goals first. in this series. Joel, you just kind of touched on a little bit, but what didn't work offensively throughout the series? Our puck uh, possession, uh, will to keep it, will to get it back, will to protect it, will to, uh, you know, fight and determination and uh, net presence, give them credit to uh, how uh, they try to box us out at the net and not get into the front of the net. There were some areas where we, uh, you know, perseverance might have been uh, a little bit more on our side, would have been, you know, I don't think we made it a little easier on them than it needed to be. these four games nullify a 50 win season? Did any major changes going forward? I don't know about that, but uh, certainly nullifies it to me. Is it most shocking first round exit for you, considering you guys were the top seed? Um, well, our division is always competitive, and uh, you know you can't, uh, you know, just lose in the way we did. Uh, that's uh, that's the that's a tough one. Joel, is this is this series a sign that the parity of the NHL is kind of catching up to you guys, or was this just a bad face a matchup of facing the wrong team at the wrong time? No, I, I, tough to say. I know that uh, anybody can win this year. It's wide open. It's a uh, it's one of those years where. Nobody dominated it really. They had their stretches where everybody had a, a pretty good run to put themselves in a playoff spot, but uh, I think it's anybody's game, unfortunately. I think I went 4 1 against Nashville during the regular season. What was different in the Nashville performance these four games? Well, they were, you know, they, 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 they raised the level of play in the playoffs, and uh, I don't think we got to where we had to be. So are you okay with the compete level throughout the series? Well, that's what we're talking about, and uh, definitely not. Why do you think you guys didn't come to compete like you had in the past? Um, I don't know. We got back uh, underneath, uh, behind early in, uh, in game one and uh, didn't score at home. That certainly doesn't help.
you know, whether it's uh, confidence or you're in a bad spot, uh, but, uh, you know, giving up a 2 nothing lead in game three was uh, a tough one to swallow where, uh, you know, that was the one where we, you know, could have put ourselves back in the series and let it go, and tonight wasn't uh, wasn't enough. So you could talk about every game, but I mean, there's a uh, there's a certain level come playoff time you got to get to, and uh, we didn't find it. And that's so, on me. Is this a harder loss to take as opposed to a game seven when you're right there? Maybe a bounce mm-hmm. doesn't go your way. It's well, it's a lot more fun, you know, because you're you're competing and uh, you know you have fun when you leave it out there on the ice when you're working as hard as you can. Take one more. When you say when you say that it's it's on you, what what could you have done differently to uh, make it... whatever buttons you got to push to find a way to make it work, whether it's lines or excitement. You guys uh, had so much playoff experience on the roster, but at the same time, this was the most inexperienced in the playoffs that you've had in a while. Did that play a role in this series? Do you feel? Yeah, I could have, but I, I mean, I, I don't. Uh, I'm not going there for that. I think that uh, we can talk about every single guy. We needed more, and that was, you know, that's, uh, you know, whether it's an experience or experience that uh, everybody could have given more.